Are there any questions about our presentations on Japan tomorrow? Yes. Which do you think is cuter? Wearing these very expensive Japanese hair barrettes like this? Or like this? Well, Angela, both have their merits. How about you surprise us tomorrow? <clears throat> Charlie? Um, yes, Miss Gatto. You will be ready for your presentation on those warrior monks from 14th century Japan? The ninja warriors? Oh, yeah. I certainly hope so. If our presentations in the gymnasium finish on time tomorrow, I'll read some more haikus. Yes, George? What's a haiku again? It's a short Japanese poem. Haiku! Hey, I'm a poet. <laughs> <laughs> Charlie, you haven't even started your presentation. Sure I have. I've been researching these ninja comic books. And in a few minutes, my Aunt Cassandra will be back from her vacation in Japan. And... She's bringing me a cool ninja toy for my presentation. Come on, let's meet her. There she is. Chucky chan what a surprise! Good to see you, Aunt Cassandra. Chucky Chan? <laughs> Mona Chan? Lily Chan? Adding Chan to one's name is a Japanese form of endearment. Cool, huh? I was talking about the Chucky part. Oh, but wait a minute, I almost forgot. Charlie, here's your package. Uh -huh. A pair of genuine toy ninja nunchucks, the ninja's traditional weapon of choice. Wow! Cool. Are batteries included? No batteries needed for these babies. Just raw human energy like this. Hi! Oh my! Don't mess with the ninja. <gasps> Hi some kind of ghost ninja. Well, now that I've broken them in, you can wow everyone with them in your class presentation. Thanks. I think... Sorry about the damage. My head's spinning from jet lag. Cool! Look at these weird serpent heads carved in them. Looks like the armories Miss Gatto told us about. Which means these nunchucks belong to a real Japanese warlord. It's not a toy. Not a toy? Wait, if I seriously hurt someone while demonstrating these in my presentation, I can get an F. Or land in juvenile jail. We better go see an expert about this. So, you like the sushi? Mm, yeah, great, really great, good. Good. delicious. Mm. <laughs> and they say kids are afraid to eat raw fish. Raw fish? I'm feeling kind of full. Mm. Me too. Nunchucks. Mm. They look very antiquated. Yeah, and old too. Let me just try and... <gasps> The ninja's stick must never be stolen. You will be sorry. Oh no! He took my nunchucks! Oh, so sorry. I don't know what happened. The ninja ghost! him! The ninja ghost? Those were his nunchucks. He came back for them. Now he's wandering around free. And he's armed. What should we do, Mr. Tetsuro? I'm not sure, but when I'm faced with any challenge, cooking or otherwise, I say fight fire with fire. Of course. We have to get trained in the martial arts. 
But where are we gonna learn about the martial arts by tomorrow? I know the perfect karate master to get us ready for battle. And she won't charge us a thing. Oh, you can keep that pair of genuine antique Edo Dynasty Yamabushi Monastery nunchucks as a bonus. How do you know what they are? I read ninja comic books. Ninja Zatman and Ninja Princess Giant are ready for battle? Well, it's only been five minutes of training. But if you keep practicing... Ready? Kick! Step! Punch! Kick! Very good! I think you ninjas are coming along just fine. Can you teach us how to do the secret brain claw paralyzer of the Ninja Masters? Um, let's keep that for the second lesson. I'll be back in a minute. You kids practice the routine. Charlie, I'm going to break this piece of wood like Karate Masters do on TV. I don't know if that's a great idea, Charlie. On TV, they show experienced professionals. Yeah, but I'm just one lesson away from learning the greatest secret of the Ninja Masters. Hi! Charlie's not completely immobilized. Me too. We need all the help we can get battling this ghost ninja. Good news! My wrist is only fractured. This cast will be off in a week or two. Plus, I got a note excusing me from the presentation. That's a good omen. What if the ghost ninja doesn't show? Don't worry. My vampire senses tell me your nunchucks and the ghost ninja will show up. And then what? We have these to battle him. I made some Kali sticks. They're the exact replica of a ninja weapon. Well, I improved it a little. The ghost ninja, battle postures! All right, Mr. Ghost Ninja, prepare to meet your doom. After him! Hurry, he's getting away! Well, children, where were you running like that? Principal Shabli? I, uh, w we, uh, you haven't seen the ninja, have you? Yeah, yeah the, the ninja, ninja ghost. <laughs> <clears throat> a ninja ghost? <laughs> Just plain ninja is already enough. <laughs> well, uh, you have overactive imaginations. He's got my nunchucks! You think he beat the ghost? No. The ghost must have dropped them to get away fast. And now Shobli's in danger. Class, we'll now start our presentations on Japanese culture. Hmm. Yes, George? Miss Gatto, why are we in the gym today? Is it for the haikus? No, George, it's not for the haikus. But if you all behave, there will be a surprise at the end of the class and you'll understand the why we're ghost. here. All right. Now, first Angela is going to tell us about the distinguishing features between herself and Japanese royalty. We share many of the same interests and talents. In fact, we both like to shop and buy really expensive clothing. Let's go. The party's over, Ghost Ninja. <laughs> All three of you are no match for me. Hi -ya! Hi -ya! <laughs> oh no! You are done, Mr. Ghost Ninja. <laughs> I am victorious, like the bamboo dragon in the house of chickens. I, oh, yeah. I don't break boards, but Zatman Ninja can send you flying! I'm an old ghost, too old to fight young opponents like you! 
Yes! You got him! You got the ninja ghost! Uh, please forgive me. My nunchucks aren't working right. Uh, they got out of control. I, I, and, and Charlie helped me. Uh, thank you, Charlie. Really? Uh, Charlie, you weren't able to do your report, but I'm giving you an A for bravery. Oh! Thank you, Miss Gatto. Principal Shobley, you seem a little too shaken to give us your surprise demonstration of your ninja combat techniques. However, you could tell us the story of your nunchucks. They look like antiques. Uh, yes, of course. Pair from the Yamabushi Monastery uh, during the Edo Dynasty. Uh, but how do you know all this? I read comic book uh, studies on Japanese culture. Should we tell him? Nah, no need to make two ninja warriors feel bad in one day. T-Rex probably didn't sound like that, but it's impossible for us to know for sure. Do you think we'll see one of those at the museum exhibit tomorrow? Yeah, I heard they have a real life-size replica. I can't wait to check it out. Plus, the Velociraptor, the Triceratops, the Seismosaurus. Think fast, Bones. Look out! Just who do you think you... Oh, gee, I... I, I mean, um... <sighs> wow. I've never seen Angela speechless before. When you're Mona the Vampire, you see some weird stuff. But that has got to be the weirdest. Class, I want you all to give a warm St. Faith's welcome to Hal T. Neander. Welcome, Hal T. Hal's father is the new natural history curator at the museum. And Hal's brought something very special to show us. Oh, that's wonderful! What is it, Hal? <laughs> it's actually very, very old dirt from the prehistoric exhibition Principal Shobley's taking you all to tomorrow. It's the prettiest dirt I've ever seen. Since when does Angela like dirt? Do you think some weird anti-Angela has taken over her body, Mona? Actually, there's something weird about Hal. Almost primitive. He's probably just shy. I remember how hard it was to be the new kid. Hal, wait for me! Would you mind carrying these heavy books for me? <laughs> wait a minute! Uh-oh, he's in for it now. <laughs> oh, no, no, not me, Hal. Just my books. It must be hard learning a new language. What's your language? German? Norwegian? Icelandic? Big Bunga! No, stop! Nah. Wow! Hal just saved Angela's life. My vampire senses are on high alert. This is definitely a case for Mona the Vampire. Hello, children. This exhibit celebrates our friends from prehistoric times. Let's visit one of my favorite Jurassic era friends. Prehistoric fossil collection. Be on the lookout for anything suspicious. Does anyone have any questions for the professor yet? Anyone? Anyone? Hmm. Mona? Just exactly how real is this stuff? Well, it's mostly replicas, except for this fossil collection. Neanderthal man, woman, and child. Where's the child? Are you okay, Hal? Oh, Hal, it's scary in here. Hold my hand. Oh, cool dinosaur. 
dinosaur eggs. Is the meaning of this? Nothing's alive in there. I saw something. It does have a hairline crack in it. Must be from the move. Now, let's visit one of my favorite Jurassic era friends, Mr. Tyrannosaurus Rex. There's something positively unnatural about this natural history exhibit. Duncan, Lily? Here. Neander Hal? Neander Hal. Neander Hal. Neander Hal. Mona? Of course! Um, of course I'm here, Principal Shobley. Move it or lose it, sister. There's no doubt about it. Hal T. Neander is the missing Neanderthal child from the exhibit. You mean just like what happened with the dinosaur egg? The professor brought Hal to life? But why? That's what we're going to find out. It's not like Mona to be late for her own mission. <laughs> Make way for Mona the prehistoric vampire. No. Oh, and Fang. Replacement. I know it's tough adjusting to a new life, Hal, but don't worry. Thanks to this genetic animation solution, soon I'll bring all of our friends here to life. Once I've brought my prehistoric army to life, I'll be worshipped by the entire scientific community as they shower me with Nobel Prizes. Then I will rule! think you're doing, young lady? We don't allow cats in here. Sorry. Um, we go to school with Hal, and we just wanted to ask him out for ice cream. Our treat. I recommend the Vampire Special. It's named after a very loyal customer. So, Hal, what area did you move from? Or should I say, era? Come on, Hal. I've got lots of money, and I'll buy you all the ice cream you can eat. Hmm. One super choco fruit sundae for my friend Hal. We've got to get close to Hal. With his experience in handling the prehistoric world, he's our only chance to stop the professor. We'll never get near with Angela stuck to him like glue. Time for Operation Eject Angela. Hey, Angela! They're selling autographed Tiffany dresses at Maison de Murray. Hey, Angela, there's a beauty spa grand opening with free facials. Like it here. How like museum exhibit? Hal stayed there. <laughs> Don't worry, Hal. We'll stop the professor, or my name isn't Mona the prehistoric vampire. Hal, where have you been all this time? We've a lot of work to do. Hold it right there, buddy. I'm Mona the Prehistoric Vampire, and I'm not gonna let you get away with this. History belongs in the past. <laughs> you can't stop me. 
I hold all the power of prehistory! <laughs> Quick, Zatman! Catch! After them, my pretties! Easy, Mr. Rex. I'm uh, sure we can talk this over. We lucky. Uh, thanks to that defective air conditioning system, there's a whole new exhibit. Poor Angela. She hasn't been the same since she got the news that Hal's dad resigned and moved them to Iceland. She'll be okay. I have a feeling she's going to meet someone just like him. <laughs> <laughs> 